Hi, welcome to Parametric House. In this uh, Grasshopper script, you can use a simple box and convert it into a polar array uh, brick wall. Uh, as you can see here, uh, the selection of the edge, if I select here the B rep, which is going to be the box, and uh, if I zoom in here, you can see that by selecting different edges, it's going to select uh, one of the four edges you have on the ground. So as you can see here, the zero is going to be this edge, one is going to be this one, two is this one, and three is this one. So you can change that by just changing the edge input. There is a flip input uh, which you can change to true. It's going to uh, extrude the inverts for the brick, but uh, obviously the false is going to be the default option. The count is for the minimum is like three uh, because you can put them on a triangle, obviously. And as you can see here, uh, the next uh, row is going to sit on the mid of those uh, uh, below them. So here you can see that it's going to move up, rotate, which I'm going to explain as we go forward. Uh, there is also a row input. So you can say one, two, three, three rows and control that. So actually, uh, this polar brick tool is going to help you to design uh, anything with a box. As you can see here, just change the box and the output is going to be updated. Yeah, can make that bigger, smaller, and that's the good thing uh, because it's going to make it a polygon. There's also an example file in this zip folder, uh, which I'm going to explain step by step what's going to happen in the algorithm. At the first step, we have a BREP input, which is going to be the uh, box we have put here. 